When searching for the best rug for your home or office, inevitably the question comes up, how do I know if I'm looking at a good rug? This video gives a few basic guidelines on how to assess quality in hand-knotted oriental rugs. Truth be told, there are many factors that go into judging quality in a rug. Everything from the types of dyes used to the rug's country of origin factor in. There are four main factors that can tell you more about quality than any others. These are knot count, thickness, density, and wool quality. First, we'll talk about knot count. By knot count, we are referring to the number of knots per square inch that were tied into the rug by hand. Knot count ties in directly to how much time and effort was put into making the rug. This, more than any other factor, will affect the price of a rug. To count the knots in a rug, simply look at the back side of it. When you turn your rug over, you will see many little squares of color on the back. Each of these is a knot. Take a ruler and count the number of knots in an inch running both vertically and horizontally across the back. Multiply these numbers through and you get an approximate knot count for your rug. It's important to note that there are a few different types of knots and some of these types show more than one square per knot on the back. We'll talk about this in a future video, but for now, you know how to count knots in most rugs. An average rug will have between 100 to 150 knots per inch. Anything over 300 knots per inch is considered to be very fine, and some of the finest rugs in the world have over 1,000 knots per inch. The next three factors all directly affect the durability of your rug. First is thickness. Thickness refers to the height of the pile in your rug. This is pretty straightforward. The taller the pile is, the more rug there is to wear through before the rug wears out, so thickness plays a very major role in the lifespan of your rug. A little tougher to judge is the density of your rug. Density refers to how packed together the fibers of your rug are. If a rug is more densely woven, the fibers support each other more, creating a much stronger body to your rug. Also, dirt, which over time is the number one killer of rugs, has a harder time working its way down to the base of the knots, where it can slowly grind and cut away at the fibers of your rug. So, much like thickness, density plays a major role in the lifespan of your rug. To test the density of your rug, take your fingers and try to work them directly downward into your rug. In a more densely woven rug, this will be much more difficult to do. Lastly, there is wool quality. This is the hardest of the four factors to judge. A good wool has a lot of lanolin, the natural oil that comes from the sheep. Lanolin gives the rug a nice sheen and its lustrous appearance. To test wool quality, grab your rug and run your fingers over the surface. A good wool will feel supple to the touch, where conversely a bad wool will feel dry and brashy to the touch. Good wool will last for generations, where bad wool can wear out in a matter of years. So, to recap, the four factors in quality are knot count, thickness, density, and wool quality. Keep these things in mind when you're looking to buy an oriental rug and you'll have a good idea of what you're looking at. And of course, always remember that for a quality, hand-woven oriental rug, come to us. Come to Serafian.